The most corrupt president in the nation's history hit a new low for behavior today even before the extended remix of a Trump's greatest grievances speech he gave at the right-wing bigotry fest CPAC. In violation of every ethics rule on the books, Trump used his official Twitter account to promote his own business interests with this retweet of a Trump Organization post that was nothing more than a commercial for his golf course in Scotland. Even worse, he tried to claim that his ownership of the luxury resort was a benefit to the diplomatic relationship between the United States and the United Kingdom, something that thousands of people in Scotland would beg to differ with. Trump may be proud of his golf course in Aberdeen, but he seemed to forget that his own Department of Justice has ruled that his tweets are official statements of the President of the United States and, as such, are subject to the same ethical laws against self-dealing that any public official would have in their official communications. Ethics watchdogs immediately pounced upon the president's latest transgression, as if he would ever be held accountable for the complete destruction of the ethical norms and legal requirements that Trump has ignored since the day he announced his candidacy. Citizens for Responsibility and Ethics in Washington, crew, condemned the president for utilizing his powers to illegally promote his own business.